people just assume that fish just appears from nowhere, right? It doesn't. There's a lot that goes into getting that fish on your plate at home and getting that fish into my kitchen. I'm very lucky where I am, my restaurants are right next to the ocean. I get the pick of the best fish that comes in. But I don't think people realise how hard it is to get that fish. The fishermen, for me, are my heroes. They're my superheroes. One of, my, one of my longest friends and fishermen that I buy from is a guy called Callum. He's got a boat called the Mary D. He's based um, in Port Isaac. In Port Isaac there's only five boats and all of them are sort of concentrate on crab and lobster. But Callum for me is, is, the, is the one that I go to buy for quality. I think the ethics of how he catches stuff is great. He's on his own on the boat, you know, which is very, very dangerous, but it's the way he likes to work. Um, and he's certainly part of the responsible fishing scheme. What that means is, if he gets a lobster, a hen lobster, a female lobster aboard, and he has, he's got berries, which are it's eggs, but it's a buried hen, he'll put it back. You know, at the moment, if you're outside the six mile zone, you can bring that in. You know, that is a lobster that's jam packed full of more lobsters. Why would you take that out of the sea? Someone like Callum puts that straight back in. If the crab's too small or the shell's soft, you put it back into the sea because he knows the true future to the fishing industry is treating your catch that way. It's being responsible and being a responsible fisherman. He considers himself to be one of the last of the Mohicans because you'd think it would be very competitive out at, out at the sea, but this part of North Cornwall when you're out on your own catching lobsters and crabs, there's not many of you out there. He takes care of the ocean as he's going along. He doesn't put too many pots out and only brings back what he needs. And I think that's very important. Um, I think characters like that, I think fishermen that are working like that, like Callum, are you know, one of a kind. Um, if they all work like that, we wouldn't have the problems that we have with the sustainability. Because um, there's plenty of fish out there, it's just the way you catch it.